And what happens if you connect a modern PC to an old monitor? Let's find out. I'm going to plug the power cable to this monitor. Um, I don't know if it works actually, I've just recently got this and I've always wanted like one of these old style monitors. Let's switch it on. The sounds they make is just bringing back lots of nostalgic memories. Um, and let's switch this PC on. I'm not entirely sure what resolution this monitor supports. Um, I'm not actually seeing anything on the screen. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, wow. That looks just... Yeah, that looks great. <laughs> and here we are, we're booting into Windows 10. Um, hopefully, it'll work out a suitable resolution. Yeah, it looks like it's doing it. Uh, we can adjust settings when we um, get in there. This should be black, but it's kind of a grey colour. We can... Move it up and down to just the alignment. <laughs> Such uh, low resolution that that barely fits. Um, we can move it left and right. Should be able to change the size. Yeah, that's cool. Um, Make it wider. I think that, and then we've got sort of a brightness, no contrast, brightness. Okay, and <laughs> these icons are huge. Let's just check the um, resolution. We should be able to go up to 1024 by 768. Yep. Yeah. How's that looking? It's so interesting seeing the curve uh, compared to um, modern flat screens. Feels like it's actually coming out towards you. Here we've got the refresh rate, 60 hertz. We don't seem to have any other options. Oh. And it does, like, my eyes can notice the flickering as it sort of refreshes the screen. Let's just run. Um, this we don't have a graphics card in the system at the moment so let's just run some of this on the built-in graphics okay the um benchmark won't load because i'm i've got built-in graphics that doesn't support some of the things so let's have a look, quick look at um, something on YouTube. Maybe we'll play something, see what it looks like. It just my eyes are straining here, just with the flickering. I'm connected to the internet, so.
Looks quite nice. In terms of um, how it all looks, it'd probably look a lot nicer with a um, dark theme. Mostly when it's got a fully bright screen that the flickering's more noticeable. You'd think there'd be a um Dark theme available. Maybe I just haven't seen the setting. <laughs> 